Aircraft carriers are symbols of sea power that have played a vital role in the projection of military power around the world. Countries with aircraft carriers have the capability to display a global presence and effectively support long-range military operations. In the Turkish context, the presence of an aircraft carrier would be a significant step in increasing its maritime power projection capabilities and expanding its influence in strategic areas. Turkey's efforts in designing an aircraft carrier, as well as how building an aircraft carrier can be a project costing billions. Turkey has pursued ambitions to strengthen its naval power over the past few years. Of course, a country located at the crossroads between Europe and Asia has a significant interest in maintaining security and stability in the Mediterranean and Black Sea regions. With growing regional tensions and complex security challenges, Turkey has identified the need to strengthen its maritime military capabilities as part of its national defense strategy. Increasingly demonstrating its ambition to increase its maritime presence. One standout move is his plan to build an aircraft carrier, a project that would change the dynamics of sea power in the region. In this framework, aircraft carrier construction is part of their long-term strategy. In an effort to strengthen its maritime forces and enhance its national defense capabilities, Although Turkey has a fairly strong navy with a variety of warships, from frigates to submarines, the presence of aircraft carriers will provide a new dimension to Turkey's sea power projection capabilities. The project is part of a broader strategy to create a stronger and more modern navy, as well as to increase Turkey's influence in the Mediterranean region and beyond. Aircraft carriers can be an important asset in military power projection at sea, providing the capability to launch and support long-range air operations. The ship is expected to become the centerpiece of Turkey's naval fleet, allowing for power projection far at sea and supporting complex military operations. In addition, the ship is also expected to be a platform for launching fighter aircraft and helicopters, expanding the range of air attacks and anti-submarine capabilities. This step attracted the attention of many parties, especially neighboring countries in the region and other global players. This is seen as a sign of Turkey's ambition to play a more dominant role in the ocean, which could significantly influence regional security dynamics. However, the project also faces several challenges, including technical, cost, and political issues. Building an aircraft carrier requires huge investments and advanced technology, which may be a financial burden for the Turkish government. Additionally, this move could increase tensions with other countries in the region, especially those with competing maritime interests. Therefore, it is not surprising that the construction of Turkey's second aircraft carrier is expected to require investments on the scale of billions of dollars. Such projects also require large technical and industrial resources. Turkey will likely rely on domestic resources as much as possible. 
but may also seek international cooperation or purchase technology and equipment from foreign suppliers to equip their carriers with the latest technology. Turkish aircraft carriers have the potential to become important assets in military power projection at sea. With the presence of aircraft carriers, Turkey can increase its maritime power projection capabilities, expand its influence in strategic areas, and make a significant contribution to regional security and stability. Although technical and financial challenges may exist, the long-term benefits of this investment are believed to be key to Turkey's national security and its contribution to global stability. Despite this, Turkey remains committed to realizing this project, considering it an important step in enhancing national security and asserting its position on the international stage. Thus, Turkey's aircraft carriers became a focal point in the evolution of the country's maritime power and sparked debate and speculation at regional and global levels. With growing regional tensions and complex security challenges, Turkey has identified the need to strengthen its maritime military capabilities as part of its national defense strategy. increasingly demonstrating its ambition to increase its maritime presence. One standout move is his plan to build an aircraft carrier, a project that would change the dynamics of sea power in the region. In this framework, aircraft carrier construction is part of their long-term strategy. In an effort to strengthen its maritime forces and enhance its national defense capabilities. Although Turkey has a fairly strong navy with a variety of warships, from frigates to submarines, the presence of aircraft carriers will provide a new dimension to Turkey's sea power projection capabilities. The project is part of a broader strategy to create a stronger and more modern navy, as well as to increase Turkey's influence in the Mediterranean region and beyond. Aircraft carriers can be an important asset in military power projection at sea, providing the capability to launch and support long-range air operations.